What is going on, YouTube Nation? This is Dark Dividend. If you guys are new to my YouTube channel, make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss future videos. A lot of changes happened in the past hour, and I just posted a YouTube Shorts on something very important that you always need to keep in mind and have prepared in case the doomsday scenario happens. But I'm back on track. A little tired. I'm gonna try to get a workout later. But this high yield dividend stock, I absolutely love. I have posted a video on it. I'm going to be a little bit more in detail because one, they just hiked their dividend, and two, they're high yield, they're cheap, and my goal is to get to 200 to 400 shares. So if you're new to this YouTube channel, make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss future videos. Smash that like button. Don't forget to check out my most recent shorts video. Uh, very scary, very surprising. Things that you least expect, but you always got to be prepared for the doomsday scenario. Let's check this dividend stock out right now. And I am just in love with this dividend stock. I have not really posted a video on these guys in a while in depth. And this is kind of a remix because my previous video, I just, eh, I thought it was okay, but I'm going to be a little bit more in depth with these guys. That's Hercules Capital. This is a business development company, less than $20. Dividend yield a 9.81%, a PE ratio of 50.06, average volume 921.50K, market cap 2.07 billion US dollars, year range is 1116 to 1909, stay range is 1549 to 1607, this previous close is 1508. What do I like about these guys? Let's check them out. This is what's incredible about Hercules Capital. It's the largest business development company focused on venture lending and the lender of choice for innovative entrepreneurs and their venture capital partners. So they have 16.06 billion plus in commitments, 240 plus IPO and M&A exits, 600 plus companies funded, 3.0 billion assets under management, 1,000 co-investments with VC and P firms, and 645 million of new debt and equity commitments. That's very interesting. So the one thing I like about these guys, there's just so much that I need to go over with you guys, which is amazing. So let's check a few of these things out. And I like their well diversification with these guys. So here's their life sciences. The life sciences companies utilize debt financing solutions to accelerate or broaden the scope of their clinical development, invest in the new R&D or commercial infrastructures, acquire external clinical assets or extend their cash runaway, past important value collection points, or share up balance sheets ahead of an IPO or negotiations with strategic partners. In this vertical, Her Hercules Capital focuses on the following sectors, drug discovery, drug platform, drug delivery, specialty pharmacy, life sciences, tools, medical devices, and more. So there's a few things I wanna go over. Drug delivery is important because, you know, there's a lot of people that need access to medications that can't drive to the pharmacy. All right, look, I, I, I own uh, Walgreens. I think that's a really good uh, company. And one of the reasons why I like these guys is when you're in a hospital where you go to the doctor's office, the physician literally can e-prescribe medications. So these guys are trying to compete with that. They focus on these type of sectors, I think that's fantastic. And this makes them competitive as well as medical uh, devices and drug discovery in life science tools. I think this is very nice and competitive right now. That's one thing that I really like about these guys and why I buy these guys. I'm gonna go over a few more things. So here's another thing they invest in and are affiliated with. Technology companies in our portfolio portfolio, I can barely talk today, I'm half awake, utilize debt financing for a wide range of activities, accelerating their hiring plan, growing on new verticals and markets, investing in new capabilities, financing, working capital, purchasing equipment, making strategic acquisitions, strengthening the balance sheet for an expected IPO or M&A event. In this vertical, Hercules Capital focuses on the following sectors. Enterprise software, security software, networking, internet, media, gaming, and more. So that's something that's very interesting, especially the gaming industry. We're starting to have colleges have professional gaming teams, which I find is very interesting. Software and security software are always huge. 
well as internet and networking. I mean, that's something that's very interesting. But I'm going to go into a few more things I find very interesting. So SAAS Finance, okay? So their capital SAAS Finance can provide loans ranging in the side from one point. Zero million to 200 million with the ability to provide eventual branches of secured debt growth capital such as asset based lending term loan financing solutions or acquisition financing so this is what's interesting their saas finance aims to fill the void in the software and technology lending markets by offering a flexible solution based on mrr or arr and other applicable metrics in SAAS companies. I swear, talk today. Given our balance sheet of over 2.14 billion in total assets, we can provide more capital than typically any other capital provider in the SAAS financing solutions. So that's one thing that's really huge right there. I'm gonna go over, hey, uh, let's do two more things because I think this is very important as to why I buy these guys. So their sustainable and renewable technology is a disruptive and evolving sector, and their financing solutions in this area have been used for growth, operations, expansion, acquisitions, and deployment of facilities. With the sustainable and renewable technology vertical, Hercules Capital focuses on companies that are disrupting traditional industries and areas, including vehicle technology, energy generation, storage, AG technology, advanced materials, industry 4.0, and more. I'm going to go over one more thing. Their special situation. Their companies involved in their portfolio have used Hercules Senior Secure Loans to grow and develop their businesses during times of change or during inflection points that are not re readily served by typical financing. Our special situations loans tend to be focused on later stage companies, often public with assets and enterprise value that require in-depth analysis and assessment on risk factors. In this vertical, Hercules Capitals focuses on many of the same sectors as life sciences, technology, and sustainable and renewable technology verticals. So I'm going to go over some things that are very important. So here's their sector, advanced specialty materials, agriculture, biomass, biofuel, biopharmaceuticals, biotechnology tools, clean tech, communications, networking, consumer business products, consumer business services, consumer product services, diagnostics, digital health, digital media, consumer internet, drug delivery, drug discovery development, educational services, electronic computer hardware, energy, energy storage, transportation, enterprise software services, fuels and power technology, geothermal, healthcare services, information services, internet consumer business services, media content information, medical device equipment, mobile, Pharmaceutical uh, services, resource management, security software, semiconductor hardware. Whoa, semiconductors, big competition right there. Small grid energy efficiency software, solar, specialty pharmaceuticals, surgical devices, therapeutics, and wind. So I'm going to go over their revenue and dividend history. So they got a lot that they bring to the table. For a business development company, less than $20. That is phenomenal. Now let's check a few more things, which include revenue and dividend history. And remember, for a business development company, 90% of what they make have to go back to shareholders. The same with a realty uh, income or a real estate investment trust. Those guys have to pay 90% of their earnings back to investors. So look at their revenue. This is in millions of US dollars. 2015, 157. 2016, 175. 2017, 190. 2018, 207. 2019, 267. 2020, 287. 2021, 280, but I'll go over a few more things. So this is as of February 16, 2023. So their full year of 2022 total gross debt and equity commitments of 3.12 billion. Their full year of 2022 gross fundings of 1.47 billion. Full record, excuse me, record full year of 22, 2022 net debt portfolio growth of 598.5 million. Record full year of 2022 total investment income 321.7 million an increase of 14.5 percent year over year the record full year 2022 net investment 
income of 188.1 million, an increase of 25.4% year over year. Record fourth quarter of 2022, total investment income of 100.2 million, an increase of 38.3% year over year. Record fourth quarter of 2022, NII of 6.1 million or 47 cents a year, an increase of 54% year over year. So, also their cash distribution of 39 cents a year. So, let's go to their dividend history. So, check out the dividend growth of Hercules Capital. Check this out for a high yield dividend stock. 2010, it was 20 cents. 2011, it was 22 cents. 2012, it was 23 cents. Then 2012, it was 24 cents. 5 cents. 27 cents. 2013, 28 cents. Then it was at 31 cents stagnant for a while. For a while. Then 2019, it jumped to 34 cents. Then 32 cents, a little bit, 40 cents. Then 32 cents, and then they add these supplemental dividends, which is not 34 cents, 37 cents, 39 cents. You're getting these special supplemental dividends, which is crazy. And then you get 40 cents in 2021, 2022, 48 cents. You get this special dividend, 50 cents, one cents, and then it went to 39 cents. So we're going to go over this. It has a high payout ratio. But I'm not too worried. This is a business development company. The revenue has done very well. It has jumped up a lot. Annual dividend, if you bought one share, you made 144 with a 9.55% dividend yield. The dividend growth in five years is 2.2%. So the number of dividend increases in the last five years is 12. So let me just jump to something for you guys to check out before you think it's a dividend cut. And the recent announcement on Seeking Alpha states that Hercules Capital raises a dividend by 8.3% to 39% share and announces a supplemental cash distribution of $0.08. Cents. So that's something very nice. They declare $0.39 cent and 8.3% to the prior dividend of $0.36. Cents. For a dividend yield is 10.81%. Payable March 9th for shareholders record March 2nd, ex-dividend March 1st. The Board of Directors declared a new supplemental cash distribution of $0.32 cents per share to be distributed equally for four quarters, beginning with an 8% share distribution for the fourth quarter of 2022. So these guys are amazing. This is why I continue to buy them. This is why I really like these guys. I think that they are very unique. They're very diverse. They're a cheap dividend stock that I absolutely love. If you're new to this YouTube channel, make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell so don't miss future videos. Comment in the comment section of dividend stocks I need to review. I'm going to be reviewing a lot of dividend stocks next week. So I have a rotation on Monday. I'm going to try to squeeze in uh, one video this weekend. We'll see. But don't quote me on that. But if you hit the notification bell, you'll know if I can squeeze in a video or not after you subscribe. You guys take care and have a good one.